Coach Dwyer, it's Katie. I just wanted to say how much I love you, how much the whole team loves you, and how we are very much praying for a quick recovery for you. You have been my favorite coach for all three years of high school. You have been such an inspiration on the court and off the court. You're just such a great person. You always make our day better by just being there at tennis. You've really helped me get through any really problems just by being there, supporting us, supporting the team, supporting me, just helped us a lot really grow through tennis and through you. We're all praying for a very quick recovery because we love you and we miss you out on the courts with us. We miss you, we love you, and we pray for a quick recovery. Love you so much. Hey Coach Dwyer, we all miss you and hope that everything's all right. Just continue to stay strong and keep on fighting. You've got this, don't give up. We're all praying for you here and hope that everything's okay. Hey Greg, it's Em. Need you to get better as soon as you can. Need you to pull through this because we need you here at KHS. Your family misses you. And Danny and Zach, and your mom and your sister, we're praying for you guys and anything we can do, we're here to help. Hey, Coach Dwyer. I'm sorry to hear about everything, but, uh, you know, we're all rooting for you. The whole team loves you. You're a tough son of a bitch. We know you got this, man. Love you, Coach Dwyer. Good luck. Hi, Greg. It's Leslie. Just wanting to um, say we're thinking about you, we're praying for you, and wishing hard for you to get well soon. I um, miss you at school. I'm seeing a lot more of Mr. Bullman. And he's nice and all, but he's not you. So fight hard, get well, and really hope to see you soon. Hey coach, I just wanna let you know that I'm thinking about you and I wouldn't have had the skill that I have in tennis right now if it wasn't for you. Um, I really appreciate everything you've done for me. Tennis is the only thing I look forward to in the day. And I know that's because of you. So I really hope you get well soon. Hey coach Dwyer, just wanted to let you know that we're all thinking of you and we're all praying and hoping that you have a speedy recovery and I wish you and your family the best during this really hard time. I also want to say thank you for the amazing memories you've given me at tournaments and during class and thanks for making tennis the best part of my day. Hey coach, I know things are pretty hard right now but we're all here and willing to do as much as we can to fight for you and help you get through this and come back home to us. We love you so much and we're all praying for you right now. Get well soon, Coach Dwyer. Hey Dwyer, um, I hope you're, I hope you get better. And um, honestly, thank you for all you've done. You've had, you've like helped us so much throughout these like past two years that uh, you've been working as our coach and honestly I'm two or three years but and honestly I I couldn't see someone better to lead the team than than you and to like keep up the, the program after Green was gone uh, honestly just like thank you for everything you've done you've been an excellent coach you've paid attention to like all of us and honestly if there's anything else that you need um you'll like you know we'll do our damn best to help you you know and um the coach like us captains are gonna take care of everything you know like you don't have to worry about us just focus on getting good on getting back uh to the shape you know all right see you dwyer best of luck to you hey dwyer guy I just wanted to say that I hope you get better soon. Um, I hope the doctors will fix you up. Uh, I just want to say that you're one of the most chill and understanding people I've ever met in my life. I really don't think that too many people in the world can handle our tennis team, but um, you do an exceptional job with it. Uh, you put so much work and effort into it. You uh, learned how to drive a bus for us. Uh, you put up with our tomfoolery at overnight trips. Just love you so much. What I'm trying to say is, uh, you're one of the last people in the world who deserves this. Um, but I guess the universe doesn't really care. Uh, you always taught me that, you know, I need to uh, keep my head down, keep my head strong, and I never really 
uh, follow through on that. I do apologize, but uh, never thought I'd have to reciprocate that message to you. Um, so what I'm trying to say is that uh, it's a tie break. It's just a lot more to see right here. So you need to keep your head down. Uh, keep working hard, you know. Hey Dwyer, um, I wanted to let you know that all of us love you a lot and we all care about you and we really hope you pull through and that you stay strong and whenever I think about you, I think about how selfless you were to everyone on the team for the past three years. There's a funny story whenever you, when we were playing Sterling in the fall last year and our sophomore year, and I thought I left my phone at Sterling after Coach Green made us run uh, sprints because Dalton destroyed the racket and I thought I left my phone at Sterling so we had to go back to Sterling and then I found it in my bag so then you had to go into the street so we could Coach Green could back up and you had to backpedal into the street and not get hit in two lane traffic on a big road and that's just one of the countless times you put yourself before all of us and you know a, a lot of people say that tennis is the one thing they look forward to and I think that's a lot of that has to do with you and the positivity you brought to all of us over the past few years and me personally, you've helped me through some tough times. You know, I wanted to quit tennis sophomore year, but you helped me. I don't know. You were, you always kept helped me to keep fighting, no matter what was going on. And this year, with all my digestive problems, even though it's been hard, you've. I've seen you fighting, and I know for sure that I'm never gonna give up because you never gave up. You never gave up on us. And you always taught us to never give up and you've always been positive to us. And you've always brightened up our day no matter what. Every week, every day, you've always been there for all of us. And we all really love you. And I really hope that we can see you one more time. And all of us are really praying for you and your family. And I hope things go get okay. Hey Dwyer, I just wanted to let you know that my family and I are praying for you. And we're keeping you in our thoughts and prayers. And we hope that you get better soon. Um, I remember last year, whenever um, we were on the bus for one of the tournaments and Jacob forgot his um, phone or forgot his phone and we had to go back and um, you had to go and make sure that the bus wasn't gonna hit anything in the back. And that's one of my favorite memories of the team, just like getting to know everyone better. So yeah, we're praying for you. Coach Dwyer, I just want to start off this video by saying thank you. Thank you so much for what you've done for me, what you've done and what you've done for everybody else and what you've done for the team. I you are an exceptional coach and overall an exceptional person. I just want to thank you for that. You're such a uh, selfless and chill guy. And I thank you so much for that. You put yourself so much more forward. Like, even with people, uh, even with a family, you treat us like a family. You always 
put yourself out you care for us there has never been a moment where you we felt betrayed or we felt uh, down because of you and you always keep our uh, spirits high you always keep us moving forward and it's just been and being a freshman just joining the team only knowing you for seven months those seven months have been a great time and a blast on the team and I'm I'm glad to have you as a coach and spend those seven months with you and I, I just really hope it can continue more than just seven months and and I know the there's not a single person on the team that dislikes you and everybody wants to have you back I just want to say thank you so much for being such a good coach and being uh being the coach of KHS unlike unlike other coaches like green I just want to thank you so much for that and I know I don't have too many memories of you but probably the the one that you have impacted me the most is the Sterling match when I was playing that pushu I was down 2-6 and with tears on my face emotion um, I was going through an emotional roller coaster you were there to lift me up and put uh, lift me up from the rock bottom and I I won the match and I would not have done it without you coach Dwyer so say thank you so much for being one of the best chill and people I know and I want to thank you so much for being my coach I, it, I'm what I'm saying might be I'll be saying it too many times but it's just really to emphasize how much I I really enjoyed having you in my life and and we all hope that you come uh, come back and we all want you to take it easy have rest and hopefully come back as a uh, as a coach of the KJS tennis team and we we thank you so much coach Dwyer Hey, what's up, Coach Dwyer? How you doing, buddy? Um, I just want to let you know that uh, me and the whole team, we all love you, and we're we're really rooting for you right now. Uh, we all really care about you, and we hope you do better. I actually think, like, you're the best coach I've ever had, and, like, you're actually one of my buddies. So I'm really rooting for you, and I love you. Good luck, Coach Dwyer. Hey, Coach. Um, I heard you're not doing too good. It's so, all right. You're gonna you're gonna beat this. You've had an extremely big impact on my life. Um, you've always been there to hit with me, to talk to me about grades, to just talk shit about somebody. It, it, you all you've always you've always been there. Um, I want you to know I love you. You you've been a a good coach to me. Um, you've been a great coach to me and to all of us. And I want you to know that you're really appreciated and you're going to beat this coach. All right. Hey, Coach Dwyer, it's Emerson. We really miss you in tennis and we just are hoping so much that you start feeling better very soon. And we're all just rallying for you. Feel better. Hey, Dwyer. Uh, I've been meaning to give you this Federer hat when I see you again as a thank you. Because even though we may not be the best tennis team that KHS has had or the most hardworking, uh, you've always been very patient and easy on us. And, you know, I appreciate that. You may think you, you've been uh, too lenient on us at times, but I think in being easier on us, uh, now I've been able to mess around at practice and have fun more and in that I've been able to find enjoyment in the sport again like I used to you know so I really you know I'm glad that I came back in my senior year and had you as a coach you know so plus hitting with you has helped my with my confidence and I tend to be a pessimist pessimist at times so I want to hit with you again <laughs> so you know hang in there and Get better soon, Dwyer. Hey, Dwyer, look, um, you're a tough guy. I mean, you basically pulled us through. You saved the team, so you got this. You can pull yourself through this. I, I believe in you. We, I mean, we're all rooting for you, so 
you know, you got this, okay? Cancer's got nothing on you. We, we all believe in you. <laughs>
where you're just amazing and and the team really loves you and we hope to see you back at the courts again and I hope you can come see me why come see me play pequeño and finally beat him after three years of playing with him I hope you you can come and watch me play for for a few more of my matches before I graduate right. I love you coach Sawyer see you soon hey coach Dwyer we all miss you and are so sorry that you're struggling we're praying for you and hope you feel better soon